These videos raise several questions on what was killing these women and girls. Why were women and men alike suddenly becoming prone to heart disease? A new research is pointing towards a COVID link and it answers those questions now. It reveals the virus may leave behind a hidden legacy. Prematurely aging our blood vessels. A lot of these patients are having aging in their arteries. Now, aging in their artery means people who are 50 or who are probably 60 are having an arteries which are much worse than what their age would be. And I think COVID is probably somehow responsible for this. But the COVID link to heart attacks in women is something that has now been established. The research was published in the journal European Heart Health. The study was done across 16 countries involving 2,300 people, half of which were women. The vascular age, the vascular health was something that was measured. The age, the actual age of an individual as compared to the age of the blood vessels that was done through a study called the pulse wave velocity. In fact, the faster the velocity, the stiffer the arteries. So is that the reason why many more women are now reporting heart ailments and are dying of heart attacks? The amount of heart disease incidents which has gone up, I would relate it to COVID-19 per se. It has gone up both in men and women. However, women didn't come at the young age with heart disease. Now they are presenting at the very young age, 25, 27, 30, with heart diseases. The study did find that women were more affected than men, particularly those with long COVID symptoms like fatigue and breathlessness. Even mild cases showed vascular damage equivalent to around five extra years of aging. Unfortunately, it has affected women more than men. We don't know why, but it's probably because they had stronger immunity. So they had uh, a stronger immune response to COVID. And this is what sort of made them worse or more affected by these blood vessels, which got stiffer, which are aging faster. And they, it increases the chance of them getting gangrene or heart attacks or even strokes. What about the impact of the vaccines? Did they not protect against severe infection? People who have had COVID infection should start getting investigated for it and see how much it has affected them. So we have had cases with COVID lung where we say that there's some lung infection going on which is persisting much beyond the usual infection should have. Well, if you've had COVID, especially if you're still experiencing symptoms, talk to your doctor about heart health and make sure to stay on top of blood pressure, cholesterol and lifestyle habits that protect your blood vessels. Three things which you cannot change like aging, like previous history or a family history. But if you can control your diabetes, if you can control your blood pressure, if you can stop smoking or smoking cessation as well as a regular exercise of fruit salads and antioxidants in your diet all these things and even yoga meditation all these things helps you in maintaining a good vascular health If you like the video, do like, comment, share and subscribe.